Welcome to the check-in, folks. Are black women underappreciated by black men? I.e., black men still obsessed with the Kardashians. Today, I'm logging on Instagram. I'm logging on my Twitter account. And I see under a Khloe Kardashian photo, Meek Mill thirsting. Thirsty. Oh, the nigga was thirsty. The nigga needed a glass of water. Thurston over Courtney Kardashian. And it would be um unfair for me to just, you know, single Meek Mills out because there's been plenty of ho ass niggas, i.e., a lot of black men, that just are thirsting and just can't get enough of the the the, the, Car- the Kardashian clan. You got rappers like Tory Lanez. You got rappers like uh, uh, Tiger. You got rappers like, I mean, of course, you got Kanye West. He's married to Kim Kardashian. But there's plenty of rappers that make mention of the Kardashian women, and they lust and they're thirsting after America's cum buckets, respectfully. No disrespect to them. They're all rich. They're all women of influence and power. But why are black men so obsessed with the Kardashian clan? Why why isn't there a group of black women or a group of uh, black women in a family that black men look up to and, 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 and appreciate and, and and have a, a desire for why do black men have to you know fit into this mold of only liking the kardashians only looking up to them like they're so fantastic and proud and they're so they're so sexually you know desirable why why have we we we've, actually we've all seen the pictures of these women Respectfully, without the makeup, without the plastic surgery, without the enhancements, we've all seen them. And they are some gremlin, busted, hit looking bitches. Let me say that again. They are all some gremlin, busted, hit looking bitches. All right. But. Here we have black men just lusting, thirsty. I seen um, a video with Tory Lanez. He did a whole video, a whole song, a whole ode to um one of the Jenner sisters. I, I believe it was Kylie. It was either Kylie or Kendall. He did a whole song and video just paying ode to this woman. And there's plenty of rappers that make mention of the Kardashians, you know, you know, you just, you know, oh, I want a girl like Kylie. I, I want to be with a girl like Kendall. I need a bitch like Kim or uh, Chloe, uh, Card- uh, Courtney. What is the obsession with this family? And don't get me wrong. They've been on TV for years. They're one of the um, longest running reality shows. And they're women of influence and power. You know, they, 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 or one of them, uh, uh, the youngest one, I believe is, is the fastest, um, uh, woman to, be, to become a billion. She's not a billionaire yet, but she's, she's on pace to become one of the youngest billionaires in history. So don't get me wrong. They are women of influence and power, but why isn't there a black family like the Kardashians that black men desire? and look after and want why is it always the kardashians why why is it you know we continue to look up to this family but let's let's really look at them none of them besides the oldest one courtney none of them are college educated none of them are college educated none of them have been to an institution of learning you know, they all got theirs in reality, you know, television. So none of them are, you know, some type of smart, you know, business woman. I mean, they all making their money 
through the, the, the influence of their mother. Their mother is a smart, strong businesswoman. I do believe that. But the, 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 the Kims and the, and the Chloe's, they're all byproducts of their mother. So it's not like they're some type of strong businesswoman, intelligent. They're all getting this from their mother. Their mother is a hell of a businesswoman, a hell of a manager. She, she's managed to get that family to become wealthy and rich. And she's allowed her daughters to latch on to, you know, men of influence like Kanye West, Travis Scott, basketball players that are, you know, relevant and influential in the, in this, in the, in the, in the, in the game of NBA. But what is the obsession with this, with these women? Just like I've said, and I made mention of, I, we've all seen the pictures of these women without makeup. They are hit, hit squad. I mean, yes, yeah, sure. They look, they look pretty. They're not, they're not a bad looking group of women. They're not a bad looking group of women when you put the makeup on and you, you know, you enhance the, 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 the butts and you enhance the breasts and you get the, the lip injection, the Botox and you, you know, you cut and you stab and you take this out and you take this this lobe of fat and you put it here yeah yeah you know they're not a bad looking group of women but <laughs> without all of that they are hit hit squad why are black men so latched on to this family why why don't we have a black kardashians a black group of girls that men want and sexually desire. Why is the why is the Kardashians the, the the pedestal, the totem pole, if you will? Why? 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 And are black women being miss? Uh, are, are they back? Are they are they being underappreciated? You know, seeing these rappers, these ball players, these men, these black men of influence and power. The strongest influence is power. Are black women being underappreciated? They have to see black ball players, black rappers that you know that they look up to, that they sexually desire, run around with these hit looking bitches without makeup, respectfully. Are black women being underappreciated by the ball players, the rappers, the entertainers? Why don't we have our own? Black Kardashian. Why isn't there isn't why isn't there why why don't we have our own group of sisters, black women, that rappers and ball players look up to and say, you know what? That's a beautiful family. All of the all of the women in that family are gorgeous and beautiful. And I want to make songs about them. I want to rap about them. I want to sing about them. I want to be around them. You know, I just want to be in a relationship with them. Why don't we have that? Why Why are they the totem pole? Why are they the pedestal? Why? Because we, we're putting them there. I'm not, we're, I'm, not, I'm not putting them there. But you are, as the consumer, as the person going to, you know, watching the Kardashians, keeping up with the Kardashians, as the person watching them on E, as a person, you know, hopping in the studio, as a rapper hopping in the studio and making a song about them. You're supporting them. You're putting them on that pedestal. You're, you you feel like, you know, this is the totem pole. This is what beauty is. You know, a bunch of hit-looking bitches that, 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 that got enhancements to their lips, their bodies, you know, a full body of makeup, you know, uh, nip and tuck away. And that's my opinion. I'm true and living. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Is the black woman being underappreciated by the black man by lusting and thirsting after the Kardashians. Thank you for joining me.